Hi, my name is Laura. I'm an artist and I'm going to show you how to paint flowers for a decoration. So there are many ways that you can paint flowers for decorations depending entirely on what kind of decoration you're trying to make. Um, so what I'm going to show you is um, how to simplify to simplify your process, whatever you're trying to do. I'm going to make flowers to decorate like a stationary. So what you'll need is some sort of paint or color um, and brush and whatever, whatever it is you're working on. So I'm gonna make one petal shape and then another petal shape. I'm gonna make it three, three petals for my flowers. Um, and if you want to get complex, you can add different shades within that, but I'm going to keep it simple. Um, and since I've got my pink brush going, I'm just going to map out where I'd like for all of them to be. So I'm going to keep doing my, uh, my petals all around where I want the flowers. And it can be in whatever configuration you'd like. I'm just going to have a little a sort of border around and I'm going to give it a little variation. Um, you can create variations on the shapes, uh, the number of the shapes. I'm going to do one with like two petals um, and it's going to look a little bit different but still carry the same essence and just give it some, give it some variety. And then maybe one up here, like it's a little budling sort of thing. Um, and maybe one down here. All right. And then I'm gonna rinse off my brush and then I'm gonna go into the green and do the same sort of, the same sort of thing. Um, basically create a simple shape that I can repeat. So it's going to be very similar. It's gonna be two petals. So start down here at the bottom. All right, and there, there we go. And then I'll do one here. And then go all the way up with it to all of the, all of the different flowers. And then afterward, uh, we're going to connect them all together. Now, if it's, you know, a little bit imperfect, it's okay. I mean, they're flowers. They can be differently shaped and look different. Have, it'll have a more organic look that way. I mean, you are a person making these, not a machine. And it's nice. It's an artistic touch. So afterward, after you're done with all that, you can create like a vine that'll go through and, uh, and connect all your flowers together. And again, like with the flowers, you can create like different shades here to give it more of a dynamic uh, and lit look. But I'm just gonna keep it simple. All right, and another thing that you can do also is rather than just have a straight vine, just give it little offshoots, little curly cue sort of things. It'll make it look a little bit more decorative. And then one at the bottom. And that is how you paint a flower or flowers as a decoration. I'm Laura, thank you for watching.